in this concert we'll be working with Newcastle Baroque uh, again. One of the things that I myself noticed in rehearsals uh, that we talk about is uh, Baroque pitch versus modern pitch and how Baroque pitch is different. Could you tell a bit more about why that is? Yep, certainly. Um, well, the idea of modern pitch A equals 440 uh, is relatively new in the history of music. Uh, indeed, it was really not until halfway through the 20th century that that standard pitch across the world was, was established. Uh, before that, orchestras and other groups and choirs and so on played and sang at all sorts of different pitches. Uh, and of course, when you're looking at sacred music too, often the pitch is governed by the organ in the church yeah. that you're playing in. And that still is the case sometimes today when you go into a, a church that you haven't sung in before and you suddenly discover the organ isn't quite in tune with, <laughs> uh, with the modern standard pitch. Um, so uh, on the whole, in the 18th century, pitch was generally lower than nowadays and groups of period instrumentalists now normally play at uh, a semitone lower than modern pitch but it did vary from centre to centre so for example when we've done uh, a program with Vivaldi sometimes Venetian pitch was more or less the same as modern pitch so we've sometimes done it at, at 440 rather than a semitone lower and indeed uh, in England, in Purcell's time, pitch was sometimes higher than, than that. So uh, you'll find uh, performance, particularly recorded performances now, sometimes at different pitches. Now, one of the interesting works that we're doing as part of this programme is Cantata 12, uh, which, when it was performed at uh, Leipzig, when it was revived uh, later on in Bach's career, uh, like many of the cantatas at Leipzig, you have surviving parts that are in different keys because uh, the organ uh, played at one pitch and the woodwind instruments often played at another one. So that you find the parts written in different keys. So there are parts in F minor, uh, which is a key that uh, a Baroque oboist would run a mile at trying to play in. And then... Uh, the wind parts and different keys. So we're actually doing that particular cantata a semitone higher than, uh, than we would normally do rather than a semitone lower. So, so there are challenges sometimes in particular works in providing the right pitch. Uh, but uh, normally speaking, when we're working with Newcastle or Baroque, it's a standard semitone lower. Excellent, thank you.